Alrighty. New place it is. Clothing store. No, no, don't look at it. Uh, let's get pizza. It's a bingo instant pizza machine. I never liked those things. They taste like artificially flavored cardboard boiled in grease. Hmm. Let's have I am one. sorry, but this bingo instant pizza maker has been shut down by order of the Newport Department of Biological Warfare. <laughs> About time, too. If you or anyone in your immediate family has enjoyed a delicious bingo instant pizza recently, please report to an area hospital as soon as possible. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. It's a box. Garbage bin. Closer. There's an empty pizza box in there. Yeah, maybe we should. It's a pizza box. Yeah, maybe we should. Ah, so I guess I'll be faking a delivery to somewhere. There's one piece of moldy pizza left inside this pizza box, and it seems to have chemically merged with the cardboard, so I'd better, um, keep it closed. Now, I don't want to eat it, but I'm interested. What she's gonna say. Ugh, no! Ah, okay. Fine. Um, dude. They got the coolest clothes in that store. The coolest and most expensive. I saved for months to buy a pair of socks there once. The coolest pair of socks I ever had. I have a question. How did you get there? You just recently gained an access to the area by getting your fake ID. Or maybe it's about the uh, franchise. And they have boutiques in other places. Go shopping? Oh, well, sure. definitely do with the change of clothes. And so what if this store's way out of my league? After what I've been through, I deserve to splurge a little. Whatever that means. Let's splurge. I look good, I feel good. Thank God they had a thermal shower in there. I needed a proper disinfection and delousing. Hmm. What is this? Looks rather rude. Well, not necessarily rude. Uh, tubes. Shuttle. Um... Tubes? What the hell are tubes? Let's see. Alright. At least I can go upstairs with the escalator. Run. It's a list of today's departures to the orbiting stations. Most of these are bound for the Morning Star, an MTI owned station in geostationary orbit above the city. All right. Today's arrivals. Shuttles are inbound from most of the orbiting stations, but traffic from the Morning Star dominates. What is this creature here? Yes, she's a sales rep. To what exactly? Uh, can I go sideways? No. Come closer. Come closer. Those documents are just for show. To create a faux retro atmosphere and put the customer at ease. I mean, if they got paper around... They've got to be good people, right? Sure. I got paper here. I have to be a good person. She's one of those chirpily soulless plastic face sales reps specifically bred for one single-minded purpose. To make you sign a colonization contract. Ooh, let's do that. Good morning, ma'am. How are you today? Just fine.
Fantastic. And you? I am just fine, ma'am. Thanks for asking. Well, isn't that just peachy? I guess. How may I help you today, ma'am? No idea. Um, let's not go there. Well, let's visit the dark side. How does it feel working for the dark side? Pardon me, ma'am? I mean, it's slavery, isn't it? Certainly not. That's a popular misconception. In fact, our colonists are given the best of care, a job suited to their talents, and a full salary. You tell yourself that, if that makes it easier to sleep at night. Yeah. That's all, thanks. That's Thank you, ma'am. Please come back and see us again. Sure. Can I go this way, then? Apparently not. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do that. Well, I guess I have... No further business here. What the hell? <laughs> Can I... no. Oh. Well, let's check the saddle. those flying cars they might have those they might have those I might be in one right about now well it's a shuttle it said so it's not a flying car well it is but it is not hello officer yes ma'am can you direct me to the MTI building? Certainly. See that huge, massive, towering building over there? That's it. Yes, ma'am. Okay, thanks. You're welcome, ma'am. This one? I suppose? Uh... Okay. Wow, it's a faux Roman palace. How very Las Vegas. Las what, miss? <laughs> Scary. I believe that circle with a big X through it is supposed to represent the destruction of the balance. These guys don't get around. Uh, why would they? Elevator doors. That's the only elevator in the building? I wonder what they do during rush hours. He looks like a receptionist. Hi there, Jerry. Gerald, do you have an appointment? Yes. I really need to see your boss, Jacob McAllen. There is no one here by that name, miss. This is a private building. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Now. But I have a pizza delivery. Thank you very much, Jerry. <sighs> Gerald! And if you do not leave, miss, I will be forced to call the police. But I'm delivering pizza for the guy. Don't believe me? Uh, I saw it blink. Got a pizza delivery for Mr. McAllen. Really? Yeah. There's been no... Wait a second. Weren't you in here before? No. Me? Nah. Uh, been, been delivering pies to the, uh, to Venice. I, I ain't been up here before. Nice hood, clean pavements, good air. I could have sworn. Oh, very well. Give me the pizza and I will see to it that it's delivered to Mr. McAllen as soon nope. as possible. Nope. 
I need a okay, signature. Too, guy. This has got to be delivered now before it gets cold. You know how Mr. McAllen gets when his mozzarella is cold. <sighs> I can't very well leave my post, so... All right, all right. Step into the elevator and I will send you to Mr. McAllen's office. But I want you back down here pronto, do you understand? Oh, and if I didn't look at the goddamn trash bin... <laughs> I would be stuck here forever. Or a while at least. Okay... There is a desk. There are documents scattered all over the desk. Uh, maybe we should take some. Make it look like we work here or something. Papers. There's nothing here that... Unless... That's my, that's my name. <gasps> and my address. Oh my... Obviously there's... God, they've been tracking me, watching me. Who would have guessed? Uh-oh. Oh. I guess he knows me. What's with the hands? You were the last person I'd expect to find here, Shifter. I've spent an obscene amount of money and resources tracking you down. Since before we knew your name. Before you even came to Newport. And then, you simply walk into my lap. Yeah. Like a mouse into a great big trap. Looking for the cheese, I'd imagine. The Guardian. Well, he's not here, I'm sorry to say. He's being held elsewhere, awaiting your directions. You do have them, yes? The directions to the Guardian's realm. No. Ah. Uh, yeah. Sorry, but I never managed to find the entrance to the Guardian's realm. Hmm. Pity, really. And I thought you'd done so well on your journey across Arcadia. At least you have the disc and the two jewels I'm missing in your possession. How so would you know that? Good of you to bring them here. I thought I might have to go pick them up myself. I have friends. Oh, you do? Yeah. You do. The very best friends, too. Don't make me laugh, girl. Did you really expect your good buddy Cortez to tell you the truth? Or to come to your rescue like a knight in shining armor? He's been using you. Tobias, Cortez, the bloody kin, all your friends. They've been using you for their own selfish reasons. They're no sure. different from me, Shifter. No different at all. They don't sound as creepy as you. Uh, by the way, how do they talk so loud with uh, still being so quiet? Yeah. How have they been using me? The Sentinel. They say one thing. I say another. It's all subjective, isn't it? Well, that's the point. Does the fact that I want to reunite the worlds and allow mankind its true destiny sound like an evil deed? Isn't that what we're no, trying to do? No, but the do? way you go about it... The way I go about it? What about the damned Sentinel? They've kept the truth from most people for millennia. They've buried the past and indoctrinated Arcadians into their own outdated faith. Now, you have been kept from the truth just as much as everyone, Shifter. You are just a piece in a grand game of chess. You're not even a big piece. You're a pawn. Now, give me the disc 
and the jewels, the dragon eyes. And then we can wrap this game up. I'm quite certain you know more than you let on about the Guardian's realm as well. No? I'll have that information too, very soon. No? Yeah? I'm not giving you anything. I have an army of devoted soldiers in this building, Shifter. I run this city. What are you going to do? Shift? Round up a mob of your friends? No. Forget about shifting as well. There are magical barriers against that in this building. Uh, I don't believe you. All right, I give up. Here's the disc and the jewels. No. No, I protest. There she goes, running. Gig, 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 gig. You see, I wasn't lying to you, unlike some of your Cortez? accomplices. You don't have a choice. Is that Cortez? You must give me what you have. Fine. No. Who the hell cares anyway? I'm exhausted and I'm... I give up. Cortez has abandoned me. I've hurt my two best friends in the world and... Maybe you're right. Maybe you're no different from the Sentinel. Maybe they're as bad as you and maybe you deserve each other. It doesn't matter, you've won. What are you gonna do now? Let me guess. This is where the heroine coaxes a confession from the villain before the final act of the play commences. Kind of like Columbo. Very well. I'm all for a satisfying denouement. Denouement? What now? I have the Guardian, I have the disc, and the jewels, the key to the tower. And soon, if you play along like a nice little girl, I'll know where the gateway is. But you won't. So you don't need me anymore? Apparently not. I thought I might, so I decided not to kill you. But now that I have the Guardian himself, your role in this game is... up. After you tell me what I need to know, of course. When it's up, then it's done. Then what will happen to me? Nothing. I'll let you go. You can do me no harm, and I'm not a cruel man. Not unusually so, at any rate. Well, how kind of you. How did you get the other two jewels? I've had one of them for ages. The other came into my possession only a week ago. How? As luck would have it. And now I have the last two and the disc. Why didn't you go look for the jewels and the pieces of the disc yourself? Can't shift. I would have, but my power over Arcadia has been disturbingly limited until now. The Tyran have proved a valuable addition to my disciples, and with their help, I've dispensed with most of my opposition in Arcadia. But still, locating the stones would have required the cooperation of the Sentinel. Now, I may be a charismatic man, but I doubt they would have told me anything. And those wretched, magical races, you think they would have cooperated? How are you charismatic? No. They were waiting for their savior, their prophecy come true. And you seem to fit the bill. Why not take advantage of that? As for the jewels, the white and the blue of the dry kin were not likely to submit to me. And that was a battle even I'd be well advised to avoid. What happened to Cortez? Cortez... I had Gordon take care of him. He was just interfering too much for his own sake. There are rules, and he broke them. He brought you into... He broke the rules. 
What will you do once you open the gateway to the Guardian's realm? Gordon Alloway will take the Guardian's place in the tower. Who? Hmm? And he will rule according to my plan. The worlds will be reunited, and the Earth will be one realm, as it was, and as it should be. So, this is all part of your master plan to rule the Earth? When you put it like that, I guess... yes. But I'll be a fair and just ruler, my dear. I have a question. What's the point? You're like, what, 60? In another 60 years, you'll be dead, and then what? Leave the kingdom to your firstborn? <laughs> I'll be around a lot longer than 60 years. A lot longer. You really don't know me, do you? Nope. You really don't know anything about me? Nothing. Apparently not. But time is ticking, Shifter, and the wheel of the balance is turning. Please, enter the elevator to your right. I want to show you something. But I have a question. Aren't we doing the exact same thing, or are we to keep uh, Stark and Arcadia separated still? So I kind of thought we were about to unite things just like he is. What do you think? Although, why should I be a guardian? What is it? We were to unite. This is the end result of the centuries of work and research the Vanguard have done. A breeding ground for shifters such as yourself. Warrior shifters. So tell me, what do you think? Oh, so there's Cortez. He was in the machine and it wasn't just a dream. Crap. So he's a warrior now? You are one sick man. Because I create my own destiny instead of sitting around waiting for it? No. Because I look to the future? No. What's so sick about that? It's the way you do things. Because you think you have the right to do this. But you don't consider the harm you do to the balance and to the people both here and in Arcadia. Well, you say it much better than I. They really have gotten to you, haven't they? Too bad. You might have made a fine addition to our organization. I could be a leader. Now, give me the disc and the jewels. And don't try anything this time. I might have to hurt you myself. <laughs> Did I really do that? Yes, I did. What's going on? So there was no Cortes there. I will ask this one last time because I am a patient man. Where is the gateway to the Guardian's realm? No clue. Yeah, it's in Reading. It's in Reading, England. Reading. I'm sorry, what? Reading. Right by the train station, there's a quaint little coffee shop. In the ladies' room of that coffee shop, you'll find the gateway you're looking for. Just go and see. I see. Humor. No. What an unfortunate way to end this seance, I have to say. Seance? Very well. <clears throat> I'm leaving now, and when I come back, I'm certain you'll be a lot more cooperative. Just make, your sh make sure you're going to England. I'll be poking around your stuff here. <sighs> Meanwhile... Or at least I'll try to. Oh, what the hell? It's a monster! From McAllen's little demonstration, I'd say that was some kind of fancy safe or containment chamber. 
Elevator locked. Hover pad exit closed. Hover pad exit. What do I do? It's a fancy. It's a fancy safe or containment chamber. No, 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 no. No, no, no. I have to make a, another round. No, not that way. I can literally feel the price of this outfit. Nice. Be fast. Faster than that. Good God. Is it still following me? No. When it's stuck, then it's stuck. Oh, it's following me. What now? Ow. It's still coming after me. Where do I go? What do I do? What the hell do I do? What am I supposed to do? I can't get away from him long enough to see if I have anything here to... I'll save it for when I really need it. You think you don't need it? Oh god. I guess he's not around. I guess he's not around. I should try again later. Go, 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 go! What else do I have? I have nothing. Uh. Can I stick him with a flute? No? Take him all the way there and run. What do I do? Is this? Uh. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Can I use this? No. I don't get it. Ask him to marry me? I'm supposed to fight it with I really don't get this organic plastic maybe it's allergic to it no what the hell if I slit him with the Credit card? No, that's not it. Hit him with a diary? No. The photo? No. Leaf didn't work. Ring didn't work. Monkey didn't work. Flute didn't work. Watch didn't work. Coin didn't work. That didn't work. Maybe I should have this ready when she bites. She? It? Or not? I'll, I'll save it for when I really need it. Uh, I guess I don't need it then. Can I come? Oh, for fuck's uh, sake. This wasn't such a good idea. Um, can't do anything. 
Hey, uh, you wanna try discussing things over a hot cup of mocha instead of all this killing April business? I guess not. Well, hell! Cortez? You've been keeping some rough company, senorita. Better be more careful in the future, no? Okay. Where have you been? What? Were you worried? No. Yes! No, I mean, I was scared you were, you know, dead. So you care about me? Of course. Ave Maria Purissima. Purissima. What am I going to do now without you telling me to get lost? Don't joke about this, Cortez. I've been in a lot of situations these past few days where I could have needed your help, but you weren't there. Perdóname. Forgive me, senorita. I've been indisposed. When I finally managed to escape my prison last night, I began looking for you. You left an interesting trail, I must say. Thank you. What do you mean? For one, the border house, most of Venice for that matter, was under guard. There seemed to be some question as to how you managed to escape the vanguard agents. Magic. So I thought. You've been picking up a few pointers in Arcadia. Just a couple. I'm turning into quite the Girl Scout. It's amazing how resourceful you can be when you're in a bind. Yeah, I see. I've noticed. Yeah, you didn't see me just flailing around this goddamn arena. <laughs> Trying every goddamn plastic leaf on the creature to make it stop chasing me. Well... How did the Vanguard capture you? With a small army, and with the help of a very dangerous man, Gordon Holloway. Mm -hmm. Heard about him. I met him, not the most personable guy in the world, and he could really do with some sun. Oh. Gordon is a, a creature of pure logic. He was split in two halves when he was a child, one bound to Stark, the other to Arcadia. The victim of terrible vanguard experiments, I'm afraid. The Chaos Vortex, right? That's him. He's magical and chaotic, half untethered. What some people would call his soul. Gordon would have been guardian had the vanguard not destroyed him. I heard the story. Can he still be guardian? The vanguard believes so. But if he did become guardian, he would twist and corrupt the balance to his own benefit. What the consequences would be, I fear to even think. Have you told me everything I should know, Cortez? About? About this. About everything that's happened to me in the past, say, week. I've told you all I can tell you. Yeah, sure. You know, I overheard a conversation between you and your friend, Father Raoul, and then McAllen. Jacob McAllen? He's here? He was. He released that mutant freak on me, so that I'd tell him where the gateway to the Guardian's realm is. Adios mio. We must get you away from here. He's a very dangerous... Who is that? Why? If it isn't a family reunion. Family? I could smell your hand in this, brother. Is the yet? The Vanguard. Was this the extent of your originality? If you had to meddle in the affairs of mortals, would it not have been prudent to show a little subtlety? He seized the dragon and bound him for a thousand years. Free at last, brother? I didn't picture you walking amongst men in a man's body with a man's name, McAllen. The balance must not have dealt you and yours with the best of hands. Are they dragons? The balance will cease to be, brother. The scales will topple and the old walls will fall. The age of dragons is imminent. Whether you join us or not. What the hell? Join you? You symbolize all that I despise. You hate and fear these mortals so much, you bring on chaos to destroy them. But you will only succeed in destroying yourself. 
Our time will come eventually, but not by your doing. Are these worlds of mortals so important to you that you forget who you are? Oh yeah, I'm um, Dragon I too. never forgot who I am. That crime is yours alone, brother. What's this? Who's Rhoda? There is still time. You are blood of my blood. Kin to my kin. You are immortal dragon. And our destinies weigh the scales of the universe. Ha, <laughs> scales. Where do you get all those cliches, kin to my kin? Doesn't it ever bother you that you sound like a badly written play? No, oh, well, I will not miss your sarcasm, brother. It always felt a little strained. Tabas! Tabas? He's an immortal dragon. That shouldn't be a biggie. said Cortez called it his heart his heart has stopped Cortez is dead I can't believe that it doesn't make sense because because he's a mortal dragon <sighs> immortals rarely die it's gone. they all die god damn I can't everybody I love dies everybody I Okay, I suppose this will be a long one. Or not. Sunday, August 6th. Still the same day. Early evening, yeah, just before sunset. How many more surprises is life gonna spring on me today? And how many for more of my friends will have to die because this is all over? Before this is all over, two in one day is just too much. Two. Who was the other one? Because the friend of mine was told that she's not dead, but was... Oh! Oh. Yeah, mother. Yeah. I can't believe that he's gone. Just like that. And the fact that he was one of the kin, I didn't even think I should have known, of course. But the, And again... I'm not used to friends and family turning out to be dragons from other planets, like I wasn't one. At least not until last week. So Cortez and McAllen were the two drakin in stock. Now I have all four jewels, or I will as soon as I retrieve the disc and the jewels from McAllen's safe. Ah, uh -huh. Actually, come to think of it, does a fall like that kill dragons? Yeah, exactly my thought. How the hell if two immortal dragons fall off the top of the building? How the hell do they die? Can I see better from here? No. Let's inside get to... Laboratore. Uh, 
How do I open the safe? Wasn't this the... Unlock containment chamber? I think yes. Showed only one thing. Oh. Where's the rest? Containment chamber open. Well, I guess that wasn't the safe then. They're growing in these tanks, but whatever it is, it's disgusting and alive. I don't know what they're growing in these tanks, oh. but whatever it is, it's disgusting and alive. What is that? It looks... God, it looks human. I guess the Vanguard are growing these creatures for a purpose. Maybe soldiers? That's one war I'll do my best to prevent. I would think one of those things just chased you around. That's an amazing view. I can see clear across the city. They're humanoid. But where's the safe? There's another elevator here and apparently it only goes up. It doesn't respond. It must require a key or a code. Such as... Can't use the stone disc for it. Or the talisman. And surprisingly not that one. Well, oh, shit. Humanoid. Yes, they are. Uh, where is this? Well, if I go down, will I find... No. And what, pray tell, took you so long? Excuse me. I'm talking to you. Stop. Screw you, Jerry. Oh, oh, the jewels are in. It's the complete and assembled stone disc forged by the fire of a dragon and chilled in the cool waters of the Sentinel Enclave. And the jewels are in the, in the thing. Didn't I try to combine it? And it wouldn't. Huh. Well, I guess it's off to the harbor then. What are they looking at? They won't tell. I thought maybe they were looking at dragons falling from the sky. But why would they be inside? <laughs> oh. Could I have gone back to... Why would I? arrivals and things. Oh! I probably need the map. And then I'll know where to go. I hope at least. Night City. No. Metro Circle. That 
it's a long way. It's 44 centimeters to run. Roughly. Flip a slip in. Flip up been attacked. Oh my god, what happened to you? <coughs> they shot me. Oh. They took the fucking map. Good. Who? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to, but they, they promised me I'd walk again. Who did? Do you? Halloway, the vanguard. I had a deal with them, then uh, when when you come back, I sent word they uh, they wanted the map, information on it. They wanted you. You sold me out to the Vanguard. Oh, I'm so sorry. They threatened me with they they said you can walk again or you can fucking die. Your choice, my choice. What did you choose? I understand. Just take it easy. Don't move too much. I'm gonna call the cops and then... No! <coughs> no, don't. I'm dying. I, they would... Just put me in jail. Listen to me. April, the map, I deciphered it. They took... They took it with them, everything. But I... I made a copy. How convenient. <coughs> Over there on the screen. Can't go there. Let's take a ride together. You told it. What am I oh. looking at? I, I played with the map you gave me, and though there was information missing, I... <coughs> Don't you tell me, it's in out? Reading, England. Anything. Gotta... they took it. See the flashing cross? That, <coughs> that's the destination on the map. Some kind of anomaly, I guess. Where is it? <coughs> Nothing about it in, in any data bank, but right next to it, there's a spaceport. The Morning Star. Transfer terminal to the colonies, luxury hotels, casinos. <coughs> if you need to get to the position on the map, that that's the way to do it. Go to the Morning Star. Halloway was bringing bringing something with him up up there to the station. Uh, I heard them talking about it. it. Sounded important. The Guardian. It's got to be the Guardian. These guys are bad, the worst. You gotta be careful, I'm fucking telling you. I'm the only chance we got. I know, get him. Get up there to the Morning Star. Go to the Morning Star. Do what you have to do, now. I will. <coughs> I'm sorry. You okay, Flipper? Well, he's dying. Well, I guess he's Flipper! dead. So that's the third one today. Yay! What a nice Sunday. Thanks, Flipper. What a nice Sunday it is. And I made a note which says When I went back to the Flipper, the Flipper, <laughs> to ask him about the star, star map, there was another surprise waiting for me. It'd been shot and left for dead by a uh, good old Gordon, my bestest friend in the whole wide world. Flipper was still alive when I got there, barely, and it turns out he'd sold me out. And not that he had a choice, unlike Zack, at least he felt bad about it, and he managed to give me the information I needed before he... Gordon took the Guardian to a colonial transfer station called the Morning Star. The entrance, the wormhole that leads into the Guardian's realm, is located not too far away from the station. So now I need to get there, somehow. I think it's time to rethink that whole colonization program. Maybe it's good for something, after all. This is turning into one hell of a long journey. The longest journey, from Newport to Alais. Alais? I think it was Alais.
and into outer space. Too bad I don't get frequent flyer miles. Uh -huh. So, I guess we'll run this uh, approximate 40 centimeters again. It's not that far, because it started from the... Yeah, it's only 35 when I come out. Might be the same when I go in. Then a little more running down the stairs, of course. I guess we're going back to that... Uh, Well, the receptionist at the place, at the Metro Circle, of course, by the Night City. No, oh, do I just walk in? Oh, I guess so. I was thinking I needed to use the thing. Tools. This is the place we end this little adventure today, and we'll come a little closer still, that's good, and continue the next one.